Ladies and gentlemen, yo, I'm weird and welcome to my workshop. Today, we're going to be tending to the fires of our soul with Spiritfarer. All right, now I don't remember exactly where we needed to go. The Iwashima countryside, let's figure that out. Other than that, I think all of my like goals, all of my objectives are all uh, like building based. Oh, there we go. Boom. Hmm. I've never actually traveled like across a island like that before. Let's see how that goes. Um, what else do I need to do? Gustav's gallery, her bungalow, an orchard. Maybe I can do an orchard. Okay. Let's see. Oh, orchard. Oh, totally. I can totally make an orchard. Excellent build. Oh, there it is. Um, oops. Wrong button. Boom. Orchard. Uh, Master's bungalow. Boom. Um, I can see some clouds. What is this? I don't understand what that is, but I can make it. I just need to go get some iron. Uh, I still need marble. so slow. Oh, looks like we just passed right in front of it, despite the fact that we should be going through it. Using, I keep trying to use uh, what you think? Space as a oh, oh, that's good. Oh, I like that a lot. Okay, we have some serious like moving around to do. Okay, um, oh boy, right from the like the very base needs to move. right there. Pride of place. That needs to go right there. It's the common room. 
I want these to all go here. Let's spread them out a little. Okay, and then... Let's see. This... There. There it goes there. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Then these. Admittedly, these should also be on the ground floor, in my opinion, but. Don't really have a good spot for them at the moment. a fan, but it's what I got. I also don't really like Atul being so high up. I mean, I know he's a frog and he can jump, but he's a big, big frog. Uh, I kind of want to make it a little easier on him. That looks a lot better. I like this a lot more. Yeah, I like that a lot more. Okay. Let's go talk to some folk. Stella, you've built an orchard! Ah, oh, goddammit. It looks almost exactly like the one my husband built. Yeah, I'm psychic. Have you seen all these fine details? Yes, he was quite the woodworker. At least until his hands gave up on him. We planted our first apple tree along with the birth of our first daughter. You should plant a tree for yourself. Of course, it'll take some time before it can bear fruit. But once grown... It makes you feel so proud, accompanies you your whole life. Oh, listen to me rambling on. I'll get out of your things now. Um, okay, so what did da, 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 apples and oranges? Just just tree, okay. I think apple tree and cherry tree. I wonder if we're gonna have to have multiple orchards. Because if these don't like grow if these if these grow and there's an apple tree here and I can just continuously harvest the apple tree that's gonna mean that I can't like I'd have to like tear it out to get get another one I wonder if I'm gonna have to build another orchard so that I can have that pear tree that I've got we'll just have to see okay perfect Stella, you've got to be kidding me. This house is just fantastic. You know, I love simple things. Simple things that make me feel good and warm inside. What can I say? I just don't like when it's too complicated or luxurious. I just don't. That's who I am. I've always been like that as far as I can remember. When I was young, many of my friends were pretty rich and famous. Humble brag, okay? You know, artists, philosophers, sports athletes. I've always attracted the finest, but that is the exact face that I am making right now. Stella's face. He's just like, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Can we get to the part where you're not talking yourself up here? But I didn't mean to look 
But I didn't mean a th but it didn't mean a thing back then, and it still doesn't up to this day. That's probably why I ended up marrying Giovanni. He was so simple, yet so elegant. So genuine, but also fun and unpretentious. Mm -hmm. And he didn't have a dime to his name. Still doesn't, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have to admit. I've got to admit, I think I miss him. I know I shouldn't. I know he's worthless riffraff. I know he probably doesn't give a shit about me now. But I just can't forget mm -hmm. about him. Hey, Munchkin, do you think you could check the mail? Maybe Olga has written to us about him, as she said she would. Mm -hmm. I would be so grateful if you did. Thanks, thanks a lot, Stella. I won't forget this. Mood down. Mood down. Bollocks. Okay. Uh, Let's go see if we can't improve her. Uh, improve any of the things we just made. Oh. Um. Zinc and ash. <clears throat> if I had more iron. So I could do the old plants. But meh, kind of. Another perfect. What? Oh, we're here. She yeah, okay. Perfect. Mm -hmm. We're here. Let's see if he's around. She goes timber. Oh, come on. Come on. Got it. Old carpet. Neat. All right, Munchkin. Olga said in her letter that Giovanni could have been around. Did I already read that letter? Eh. Knowing him as I do, I have my doubts. He wouldn't linger in a place like this. But who knows? Maybe if you ask around, we might find a clue or two. I'll leave it. To, I'll leave you to it. I don't want to go too far. The humidity here is killing me. Go, go. I I trust you'll find interest interesting stuff. Who? Oh? I don't remember his name. That night didn't call for names. If you know what I mean. I do remember his legs, though. Oh, brother. Wait. He has a wife? He didn't say anything about it. He did say that he was going to Furugawa. Well, if you ever meet up with him, tell him... Tell him that Eileen misses him. Oh, my. I do this all day. You're just standing here. I mean, I suppose I could also stand in one place all day. I mean, I'm physically capable. I mean, I suppose not right now. Uh, for those that don't know, which is probably all of you, uh, I actually uh, hurt my knee a few weeks ago, and I'm not supposed to walk for more than like an hour a day. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not supposed to stand or walk for one to three hours a day. Or for more than one to three hours a day. Is that it? It's all the stuff? All the stuff! Yeah! Okay, let's go tell, uh... I forgot her name. Cat lady. Let's go tell the cat lady that her uh, her husband is uh, elsewhere. He was here, you say? And he met someone? No. Don't tell me. I don't want to know. Okay, maybe I do. Just just a tiny bit. Only where he went. Furugawa. 
I think I know where that is. I've heard it's a lovely place. At least that's what the brochures said. I've always loved these colorful flyers. They make you travel without leaving your seat. Mm -hmm. All right, Munchkin, let's check it out. Oh, go this way, go that way, blah, blah, blah. Mushrooms. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna have to sleep and pass the day so we can get moving again. So we need to go to Furugawa, which I can I can never remember where these places are. Uh, Hasaki, that was. Wait a minute, we were just there. That's that's ever so slightly frustrating. All right, guys, wake up, you lazy bums. Okay, what am I doing? What do I what am I doing? I am going to go make some more iron real quick. Um just so that I can get that old plant out of the way. I can make it now, so I wanna just do that. Very unhappy. I'm not being dramatic. You're being dramatic. Uh, I forget what you like. Uh, mood. Likes exotic food. Uh, fish curry. Ha! Stella. Found my weak spot again, did ya? This complex and exhilarating blends of flavors. Yes, exotic delicacies are just my taste. Oh, yes, quite good. Quite good indeed. There you go. Quit your bitching. There you go. want to make sure you guys get watered. Oh, what's going on? What am I looking at? Is this another nebula thing? What's going on? Oh no, it's just the dark, the darkness. The darkness. Uh, yup, what's up? Oh yeah, sure. Um, you like simple food? Or old-fashioned food, maybe? I don't remember. Here, try this. Absolutely delicious. Nothing more reassuring than an old-fashioned dish like this. Love it. Thank you very much. You're welcome very much. I am amazing. There we go. I do like iron, because I can just... Uh, once I get it up to temperature, I can just leave, and it'll still successfully... Uh, successfully complete All right. let's make that old plant real fast done cool there we go again. Mm -hmm. All right, we're here. Let's go down. 
Oh, Daffodil. All right, here we go. I didn't mean to pet Daffodil right then, but she deserved it. Okay. Let's look around. That's funny. Is it his cologne that I smell? This peculiar misc of musk and nonchalance. What does nonchalance smell like? He must have been here recently. Quick, Munchin, let's ask around. Is it going to be the first person we talk to again? Giovanni? That name. Don't say that name. He almost broke up my marriage. Came here a month ago. Big man. Thinks he's the boss. Good thing my wife came to her senses. He apparently didn't like the weather. Good riddance. Oh my. Where's my brother? Blah, blah. Okay, it's you. Okay. Um, what the? Why did I go up? That was weird. For a moment there, I went up when I opened my, my hat up. No, thank you. Uh, whatever. You're not what I want. Hello, visitor. Welcome to the world. We're not for another tour. Tour will be in shortly. Take about five minutes and covers the rest history of the city after you change the name. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Ready? No. Uh, I don't want to take another tour. Get out of my sight. Well, fine. Mm -hmm. A nice a rice patch needs constant nurturing. It's full-time job. Okay. You. You. That. Get back to it. Yeah, you should. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what you're getting back to. Oh. Whoosh! Hello, my friend. Okay, that's not what I wanted. I guess the only thing left to do is take the tour. Talk to everybody, except for that kid on the lamppost. Oh, maybe she's done. Maybe like. Maybe that was all I needed, that he was here and left. Oh, I'll take the tour. Yeah. To begin, a powerful symbol. Erected to keep spirits away and bless this island for future generations. You can sometimes see islanders stop by this tree in the middle of their journey home. Maybe to remind themselves of a lost brother, their sick child, past lovers. Legend does say that they have heard it talk sometimes, another piece of this island's rich culture. I personally have never experienced loss. Some say I always think my person personal problems. I always think of my personal problems, never thinking of others. Well, no matter, as long as I can carry on doing these tours. Right. Yes, I know you're trying to give a tour. I'm here for that tour. Since this is a vibrant city, we have a Raccoon Incorporated location. Considered by most to be the finest source of materials and wares, it is also coincidentally the only merchant business in town. Founded by Theodore Raccoon, these shops are a staple of a thriving economy. Fun little fact, anyone who joins Raccoon Incorporated must legally change their name to Theodore. I suppose it's a way to honor their founder, truly a sign of devotion. I myself do not shop at this particular establishment. I make my own clothes and furniture. This isn't particularly noteworthy, but it is a small tidbit in your tour guide life. Okay. Please stop what? This shrine was built using only the finest metals. From the ash of the ashes of the of the past guardian tower, these shrines tell the story of our past. And that story is, give me a second, I'm not sure actually, which is why it's so important. In my forgetfulness, I remember the purpose of this shrine. <laughs> the moral being, of course, always remember your heritage. A powerful thought. Let's move on. This concludes our tour. Four hours Tours is grateful for your participation. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again. A gratuity is expected if you enjoyed the tour. Sure. Amazing. I knew you had an educational spirit. Thank you for believing in my teachings. You're welcome. 
let's get out of here. This is fun. Hey, kid. I live a simple life here on this lamppost. What a bust. Sorry, Stella. I. Oh, damn it. Enough is enough. I'm done wasting my time. I won't be looking for that hoodlum anymore. I don't need him to be happy. I don't need to hear his stupid jokes and incessant yammering. I don't need to be suffocated by his floral cologne. I thought it was nonchalance cologne. Whatever. Uh, I don't need to have him constantly showering me with praise. I don't need to see his flamboyant mane. And I don't... I... Let's go back to the boat, Munchkin. Yeah. Yeah, you got it bad. Oh, there we go. Okay. What's next? We've got some mail. Um, how do I read this again? There we go. A letter from Olga. Astrid, big news. You'll be glad to know these sources have finally panned out. I heard my sister, Masha, might know something about your husband's whereabouts. You should go and drop in on her. Okay, cool. Um... Neat. Gimme. Alright. Are you coming over here to, so we can talk about this? Yep. Yep. <clears throat> Masha, you say? She's her sister. She might know something about Giovanni's location. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Good. Let's go talk to her then. She is... How to put it? special. Me and her, let's say we've never been friends. And Stella, thanks for playing Messenger. You're wonderful. Cool. Find Olga's sister. Vandava. Let's go, like, sail the seas. I'm sure that will, I'm sure that'll get us there. All right, what's this? Um, South Point docks. It's that again. Uh, let's go to Olga, I guess. Like, I don't know what else to do. Um, I do have an idea of something else to do now that I think about it. I think that I'm not gonna make you sit here for this. I'm gonna call this an episode. Uh, if hmm. yeah uh if you i've totally botched this like a hundred percent i'm weird and these have been my workings <laughs>